Hello guys, it is the next day. As you can see, Cal and I did not go Christmas decor shopping after we ate because to be fully honest, we were in a bit of a food coma and we were just like, let's just go home. We went and saw Shane and saw Lily and then we came back home. But yes, it is the next day and today is gonna be such a fun day because Cal and I are throwing a little barbecue situation at our house. Here's the plan, we're doing like a little potluck situation. Cal and Ash's boyfriend are going to be making pork belly burnt ends, lobster tails, and then everybody else is kind of making a dish. I'm gonna do some garlic bread. Also, I don't have a voice because I talked so much yesterday. That's what's going on. I'm gonna do garlic bread. I'm going to do uh, mashed potatoes. Ash is bringing mac and cheese. Alicia's making dessert. I told her she better do a cooking with Alicia on her channel. And then Murph is bringing a salad. And I think Ollie's bringing another dessert. So it's gonna be so much fun. We're gonna have a delicious meal. And then after we're gonna get high and watch Spirited Away. <laughs> it's gonna be amazing. But today, right now, I'm making some breakfast. So I'll show you guys what I'm doing. I started making myself some soft scrambled eggs and then Cal was like, wait, can I get in on that? So I'm transferring it to a larger pan, making some soft scramble, whisked up a few more eggs and we're just going to slowly, slowly cook those and then we're making some bacon in the cast iron skillet and we're listening to twice. What a day. Bacon is getting crispy and then to make soft scrambled eggs, I have it on low, 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 low heat back there and you just keep mixing it to form these nice curds just really slowly and it's gonna be delicious. Cal's on bacon duty. Yes, I am. We've got the eggies. They look so good. I topped full of flaky salt, a little pepper, and then I also, when it was still warm, mixed in some of this Miyoko's cheese spread. This is the garlic and herb cheese spread. It's like a plant milk, but honestly, like boars and cheese. You mix it in, so delicious. And I know they look underdone, but they're like perfectly cooked. Yes. How were the eggs, sir? They were incredible. I just gave them a chicken treat and someone choked a little bit. I think they're good. The eggs were bomb. So, so good. Last week for a main channel video, I did Battle of the Recipes. I'm not gonna tell you whose recipe this is, but I made a cookie recipe blindly and Cal and I both agreed, best cookies we've ever made. Oh my God, they're amazing. I really think maybe even best cookies I've ever had. Better than like Levain. I know this is crazy. Better than Crumble. Better than anything. They were I almost so- almost fainted. They were so good. Cal almost fainted. They were, they were so good. We both had the same reaction. I'm baking them in batches. I had a lot of leftover dough. I'm baking them for the party tonight, and it's not really a party, just for tonight. And I think everyone's going to love them. Oh my God, they're perfect. Here's batch one, looking gorge. All right, I'm gonna get the next batch going. Well, I made them all into little dough balls with my hands. All right, cookie sheet. Cal made me a, what kind of latte is this, love? Just a regular almond milk. Mm. Did you want flavoring in it? No, that's delicious. Cool. Wow, <gasps> I do want flavoring in it though. You know why? Why? It's time! <laughs> I don't have Mariah's vocals. I have peppermint, stevia. Oh my God, my first peppermint drink of the season. And I'll be making them at home this year. Oh, why did I do that? Oh my God. I stirred it so vigorously on the cookie sheet. Oh no. Oh my God, brain is not on yet. All right, next batch going in. I baked them for, I think 12 minutes was perfect. Everybody, I'm back with a surprise. I cut my hair. I have bangs. Twins. Twins. <laughs> just kidding, this is a clip-in from Amazon and I was just curious what it would look like. I don't hate it, but I don't think I'll be doing it. Also, I don't like the hair in my eyes, they're kind of itchy, but I'm gonna FaceTime Alicia and surprise her. Hello. Surprise. I love it so much, babe. She looks like mommy. <laughs> she loves it. Cookies are baked. We are out and about. Hello. Running Target spans. vlog, Target I'm excited. Vlog. <laughs> We're here. We have to get some things that I need for tonight but didn't want to get Costco sized versions of. So we're gonna get normal sized version things at Target. Yay! Oh, me I out. almost hit you with it, so sorry. <laughs> you moved quickly though, I'm sorry. Oh my God, there's a whole section for advent calendars. <gasps> what do we got? We have, looks like maybe chocolate. We've got, <gasps> for dogs, cookies. These are cute beauty. Some more chocolate. We have, uh, what is that? Wellness, masks, cats. Should I get them for the dogs? Yes. Wait, that's so cute. <gasps> Little cookies. I love it. Oh, jeez. 
fizzy animal bath bombs. That's so cute. More cookies. Okay, I'll do them for the dogs. Need three of them, obviously. Can't have anybody feeling left out. This is so cute for New Year's Eve. And this looks like the skirt that I bought from that Instagram ad. And I bet it's like a fraction of the price. Let's see. $25. Oh my goodness. That's so cute. Check it out if you want one. Look how cute these little Christmas slippers are. Kind of nice. Kind of naughty. Which one are you? Right now I'm feeling kind of nice. <laughs> That's the first. Oh, look at how cute these are. We got reindeers. I love the Merry and Bright too. These are really cute. All of the so little flannel. Santa's little helper for Holden. <laughs> They're so cute. That's actually adorable. Girl. They have so many little fleece pants for Christmas and for the winter. You're not gonna tell them what just happened. I did. Right before I started this clip, I did almost fall back and hit my head like on almost this. almost collapsed. More slippers. <laughs> so cute. Slipper socks. I think these are so cute to keep you warm. And then also if you wanna like have matching family pajamas, these are a really good price, $10 for matching pants. I'm like, should I get them for all of us? Should I get Cal and I matching ones? <laughs> it is officially Christmas shopping time. <gasps> Look at these cute little Christmas trees, Ollie. Vlogmas is here. I'm scared, but it's here. I walked by this and I am obsessed with this. It's a little... <gasps> decorative tree. Ollie, look at this. It's a little tree. Is it a pillow? It's a little pillow, but this looks like it would be from Pottery Barn and like I really like expensive. Your dogs would eat this. Yeah, Luna would think this is a toy, but it's so adorable. I love it. <gasps> I am getting a few of these. They are so cute. I love them. I'm so excited for Christmas. I'm gonna start <laughs> slow, but I'm gonna start accumulating things and we're gonna start decorating next week and it's gonna be so amazing. There's also, oh, <gasps> stop. <gasps> cute for the black couch. I do think I want to go with color, but just so everyone knows, these are adorable. I think I'm actually going with the green. They've got throws, red throw, add some nice color, and then look at this little white puffy pillow. I mean, this could be for all year round, but it also looks like a snowball. These little sets of earmuffs and gloves and little beanies and scarves are so adorable. I love all the colors. You know I love me an earmuff and a scarf. Oh, they've got some like little pillow slides. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not getting anything that I actually came for yet but I was called over here baking things and little like Christmas tins I want to bake people cookies I love this tin we got cookie cutters <gasps> spatulas everything is so cute oh my god the oven mitts this is adorable they have a little toy <laughs> target cart with like little oh my god little foods that is so cute and a target cash register Holden's obviously too young for these things still but next year it's time I almost fell again thank you <laughs> They're playing Christmas music and we're just we're just walking by the Christmas section. We're gonna wait. They still have Halloween candy out though and it's on sale. Love that. I can feel wait, I can Vlogmas. Have aesthetic That's so Christmas cute. Vibe. Rem Life Vlogmas is, is thawing. She's thawing currently. Hey, oh my god. Get in the section and say that. Rem Life Vlogmas is thawing. The way I just do whatever you tell me to. <laughs> <laughs> it needs to be studied. We are here for this section. That They've looks got good as hell. Hot cocoa whipped cream, peppermint whipped cream, gingerbread whipped cream, eggnog, salted caramel, salted caramel whipped cream. We've got peppermint mocha coffee. It's finally my time. If Califia, Califia, I don't know how to say it. Calif, Calif, there's an I. Califia, Califia, peppermint mocha latte. Oh my god, I think I want this one. Yeah, I'm gonna do this one. I heard that. What? However you say this brand, also came out with a matcha almond latte. So I'm gonna try this. And they have holiday nog. So many delicious drink options. I might try the holiday nog too. I don't know if I like eggnog. I think every year I try it and I forget if I like it or not. Stop number two. Let's go. We've got Alani new and poppy packs here. Just an FYI. I found Lore DIY's Christmas gift. Oh, Squishmallow wait, DIY wait, jewelry. Pretty cool. This is so, and there's a Malcolm. She loves Malcolm. No joke. The toys at Costco are great if you have kids in your life and you're finding Christmas gifts or if you are donating to a toy drive. I always come and get a bunch of fun stuff every holiday season. So come to Costco if you're looking for good gifts because they're a good price and they're like really big stuff. Like, look at that. I would have killed to have this as a kid. So if you're looking for a good place for toys for a toy drive, come here. They never miss. Little Squishmallow ornaments. These are so cute. $12.99. That's a pretty good deal, actually. If you want to make your tree look adorable. Costco is popping today. You're also sitting in the car balancing on the giant gingerbread house that I found. Wait, this is so fun. Cal asked us to grab a couple things for his bachelor party that he, not his bachelor party, his friend's bachelor party. And you can't beat a Costco price. So we're grabbing a couple things getting some stuff for tonight. <gasps> Wait, these clamps look amazing. I was like, shells. Linguini with clamps and shells. You can keep them as decor. We are here for the big money 
big ticket money item. Oh my god, these crabs look good too. We are here for the lobster tails. Oh my god, I'm screaming and so many people are watching me. We're here for the lobster tails. You excited? We need to get some lobster tails. Also, look at this giant gingerbread house that I found. It plays music and has lights. It reminds me of something that my parents had as a kid, just like a, a lot bigger. It's gonna be so cute. I think I'm gonna put it like in the entrance of the house, but lobster tail time. I saw it's Dungeness crab season and these look really good. Should we do a seafood boil, Ollie? Yeah. I think so too. We'll come back soon and make it fresh, but good to know they're here. These taste <laughs> kind of expensive. These taste like Chick-fil-A chicken nuggets. You get a giant bag and so good in the air fryer. The best peppermint bark to ever exist. Kirkland Signature brand peppermint bark. How much is this? $9.99, giant thing. So good. Actually kind of expensive, but worth it, truly. I also got, this is roasted Brussels sprouts and butternut squash. That sounds amazing. I got cranberry sauce, I got sliced turkey, and I got gravy, and I'm gonna make a sandwich. Back on the box. Last thing we need is Hawaiian rolls, and I was really hoping they'd have them here. And lo and behold, I see these orange boxes straight ahead. Yes, yes, yes. Bread. Brioche slices, wow, that'd be so good. Got lots of rolls. There we go. Mission accomplished. So all you have to say for yourself? Yes. And I'm excited about my gingerbread house, I really am. <laughs> We're home. I'm gonna do a haul of all the stuff we got from Olive Atelier the other day. We got this giant, Okay, it's called a breadboard, but we're gonna use it as a charcuterie board. Especially when there's 20 people coming over for the holidays. I need a cheese board big enough for 20 people. So we have this here. It's very large. Here is piece number one. Also, Olive Atelier was so nice to give me all these things. So this is what they gave me. Next up, I got two more wood things. We have this circular one that I was thinking we could use as like a, a tray for decor, perhaps. Sure. Yes. Cute. And then I also got this large board. Also for cheese boards, that's not as big as the first one. Cause we have like medium ones and not a large one. So this is that. That definitely that's looks like, quiet. you know, very rustic bread and cheese go on that. Like a big cheese It's wheel. called a bread board yeah. and it's really pretty. And it's got all these fun little like uh, scratches in it. A lot okay. Of character. And then last but not least. Oh, actually I got a couple other things. One thing is at Ollie's house because it was too big. And then another thing's in the garage. And I'll show you that when I put it in the room. Last but not least, look at this giant rock bowl. Ooh. That's cool. Uh-huh. What are you putting it though? I don't know. Whatever you want. <laughs> That's my haul. I put Ollie to work I to feel like Kendall Jenner. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite part of lobsters is taking the meat out of the shell. Cut them down the back. Ooh. And then you crack it open. And then we pull the inside out. Ooh. And look at that. Ooh. Gorgeous. Update time. Update time. Everyone's here and this mash looks. Look at this looks like tender green. Smashable. Look at this. Wow. Oh. Smash or pass. Smash. Smash. That, that looks bomb. like macaroni and cheese. in a pot. That's a. <laughs> oh. Looks like a bomb ass pizza. Are these the Hawaiian rolls? Yeah. Ones? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> We need you need sound effects from your friends that you can put in your vlogs. Shane, that, that hear me out. So hear good. me out. You need my Remy. Yeah, wait, I love that. <laughs> and then you need an oh freaking God. Oh my God. <laughs> I don't know if anyone cares, but Shopify Shopee has sixty percent off. She said she knows Remy's vlog will sell oh, out. Black Friday. And that's so fucking dope. And that's wait, so tell your vlog. Did you tell Yeah. I was just telling no, you. Remy's like, you know what? I've been reading to meaning to re up my Alicia Burke. <laughs> She's like, I'm oh gonna need to throw out all my chanel. <laughs> I mean, designer, baby. Flavors. Oh my oh god. god. <gasps> Asher mac and cheese looks amazing. Oh. That looks so good. Thank you, thank we you. got barbecue, right. we got salad, the mm. coleslaw. The slaw pole. My bread. My bread. Wow. My, my bread. mash. Hey guys, welcome back to Cooking with <laughs> Remy. I am your guest chef today, cooking with Alicia. And today we are making dessert, not just any dessert. We are talking farmer's market peach cobbler. Okay, so here's the thing. I'm so scared. It's not fully done, but we don't want to burn it. But it looks, oh, it looks great. But Remy missed it and she was like, why is it still powder? And I was like, it's not done. It's not done. <laughs> It's not done, guys. 
guys. You just baked raw flour. <laughs> it's not done. She and it ate. sounds like I'm gonna have a lot of leftovers. <laughs> <laughs> you know when you you know how like it's weirdly embarrassing when you bring something and no one touches it? <laughs> like to like a family thing? It never happened. Yeah, well you luckily you yeah. luckily God blessed you and he said you don't need to experience that just humiliation. <laughs> then you're embarrassed, you're like, oh, yeah. All right, walk us through the so, dish. This is, um, it's still simmering. <laughs> <laughs> but this is how we know it's gonna be good. <laughs> let's get munching. Well, let's get munching. Hello, guys. Oh my gosh, it is the next day. And when I say it's the next day, it's the next night. It is currently 5.54 p.m. I just got back to the car. I need, like, some light. I just got back to the car. There we go. I just left the Pretty Basic Studio. Oh. Hello? Just left the Pretty Basic Studio. We had a big filming day, episode one. I was so tired, so I was really trying to push through episode two, though. I got my energy, finally, and the episode went so well. It was so much fun. Now, I'm going to stop at the grocery store on the way home. I have to pick up some eggs and some bread and just some, like, random staples. And then I think that Forrest is making us dinner tonight. He's so sweet. He's staying with us for uh, a couple weeks, if you guys didn't know. I don't know if I told you. He's staying with us, and he wanted to make us some meals to say thank you for letting him stay, which is so sweet. But let me call Cal and check in really fast. Hello. Hi, baby. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. I just finished PB and I just got back to the car. Amazing. Are you hungry? Um, I am getting hungry. Oh, okay. Um, I, well, I just want to let you know that Forrest isn't planning on making dinner until like probably later-ish. Oh, okay. That's fine. I'll say after seven. I'm going to stop and get some groceries on the way home and then I'll be home probably within an hour or so. Okay. Sounds good. Love you. Love you, baby. Okay, bye. Okay, light back on. Oh, also last night was so so much fun. I'm going to insert the little TikTok that I made this morning of Alicia making her dessert. It was so funny. We had such a fun night and then we watched Spirited Away and then we went to bed. This is the unex this is the exclusive. <laughs> unexclusive. <laughs> This is the exclusive, <laughs> exclusive Remy's secret recipe. Don't put my name on this bitch. <laughs> it's secret. not good. No, 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 no. It's not no. Good. Remy's secret recipe. Um, uh, exclusive. Okay. This <laughs> what is this giving? Why are you giving me <laughs> so hard? A power move girl on this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, this, will, this will be my side. <laughs> Ash, come look what she's doing. I told her you were gonna be mad. No, because this isn't hers. I said I'll have this side. Okay, so the next step is <laughs> after you mush it together, you're just gonna throw it right back in the oven. Throw it right back in for a nice crisp little browning. <laughs> Wait, I think mix that part too. So, oh, so are we mixing or are we not? Oh, I think the dry part, the part that's just raw flour. See, it's just a little top part. Do you want the broiler on? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Would do you have your flame thing? Yeah! And then after, because we always knew we were going to brulee it. Yes, bitch! I don't like it. Oh, okay, okay. In and out. Ooh. Go. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the elbow. What did you just say? What is it? Is it not? What is it what not? Is it? I think it's good to go now. Yeah. Um. Yum! I want some. <laughs> <laughs> oh, get close. It literally looks like mac and cheese or pizza, pizza, like with mushrooms. <laughs> Ooh. Yum! <laughs> I can't wait for this to be what you asked me to make you for your birthday. It's on fire! <laughs> 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 Wait, what? Yeah, it's on fire. Did it reignite? Did it reignite? It looks really hot, be careful. It's <laughs> 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 good. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. good. It's good. Well, thanks, guys. <laughs> I think they're lying, but that's awesome. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Let's get lunching. <laughs> actually good bye oh shoot i just remembered actually i do have to stop at target on the way home because i am wrapping up all of the halloween decor and starting the christmas decor tomorrow and i need to bubble wrap all the candles and like breakable things so target as well let's go got the eggs got some white bread and sourdough bread made it into target and it's getting so cold outside i'm so happy i think i just need maybe i'll do two just to be safe 
two bubble wraps. Also came to grab, here we go, peppermint tea. These holiday sugar cookies look so good. Holiday macarons and peppermint bark ice cream, hot chocolate ice cream. I think I'm gonna have to get some of that. I'm gonna see if there's a smaller one, but I need that. I found peppermint mocha creamer. It is time. They've got all the decor starting to come out. They've got my tree lighting switch that I love so much. So cute. The little train track thing is also adorable. I am obsessed with the favorite day brand. Look at these Santa Rice Krispie Treats holiday tree pancakes. So cute for Christmas morning. Gnome sugar cookies, all the fun little sprinkles, <gasps> peppermint. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Hi guys, I'm home. I took my contacts out. I am just about to take all my makeup off from the day and I came home to the boys making me homemade tonkatsu and rice and stir fried cabbage and I am beyond excited about it. So let's do a little makeup remover situation. Got our headband on, got our little wrist guards on, cleansing oil. Get all up in here. I have a very early morning tomorrow with two very important meetings that I need to be up and chipper and awake for. So I'm gonna try and go to bed early, er tonight. And then I'm going on Alexa Losey's podcast tomorrow and just getting some other work stuff done. Gonna put on some comfy pajamas and let's go get some dinner. There we go. Cocktails with cows at work. Yes, spicy margarita. Yes. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. Luna, don't like that. Look at this amazing dinner that I was made. Katsu, rice, dumplings, and cabbage. Thanks, guys. Everyone's so oh, silent gosh. when I vlog. <laughs> I don't know what to do. <laughs> Hello, guys. It is the next, next day. How are you all doing? Also, I didn't tell you guys, but I'm getting my ring resized, so I don't have it for the next, like, they said one to three weeks. So hopefully it comes back soon. I feel naked without it already. Hello. Okay, so it is the next, next day. As I said, yesterday I had the really busy work day tons of meetings. I have another meeting in like 45 minutes that I am trying to wake up and get ready for because these are very important meetings and I feel like maybe you guys can guess. You should guess down below what you think that they might be for but so yes, I'm in the midst of doing those. I'm just having some breakfast. I have some turkey bacon and some eggs here. I wanted to soft scramble them, but I cooked them on too hot of a pan, so they're just normal scrambled eggs. I made myself a peppermint mocha latte. Ah, it tastes like the holidays. And you might be wondering, what is this thing that I have in my hair? I saw this, my friend Belle had this on her stories. It's like a little Velcro clip, if you can see. Let me zoom in. A little Velcro clip, and apparently it's supposed to give the front of your hair some volume, or your bangs some volume. I'm also, you guys, really thinking of like, actually chopping my hair this weekend. Let me show you a photo. I saw a video of Olivia Culpo and I loved the length of her hair. Like it's still long obviously, but like a lot shorter than what I have going right now. And that's actually kind of like the length of my, my real hair right now. And I think I'm gonna do it. I really think I'm going to. I think I'm gonna keep the extensions in because my hair is still trying to grow out, but it is growing quickly. It's still trying to fill out and even out. So I think with the extensions, I can, you know, cut the extensions and have like a nice full head of hair until my hair all grows in. But I think I'm kind of over the long hair right now and I wanna, you know, maybe like six inches or so or however much that is, like chop that. I think I'm gonna do it. Anyways, good morning. Cal just left with Forrest. Their best friend's wedding is this weekend. That's why Forrest is here. And Cal is the best man. So he's been doing a lot of planning and the bachelor party weekend starts tonight. So it's just myself and the girls. And we will see where the day takes us. We have a pretty busy work day. That's why I'm all full glam. I'm wearing the uh, Kiss little lash extensions too. And I think they look so pretty. They look a little bit more natural than like a lash band. But yes, I am going to eat my breakfast and I need to get ready for this meeting. And I'll catch you guys later. Bye. Hello vlog. It is much later. I saw you for breakfast this morning and we've been working all day. I just tried to make the giant jalapeno popper that I got. It didn't work out quite right, but I have to say it tastes so much better. It's so good. The crunchy outside did not stick, but like flavor wise, mmm. It gave. It's so good. No. I'm gonna clean up all these dishes and I'll see you soon. Hello guys, okay, just wrapped the work day. I just cleaned up the kitchen from all the dishes that I made for filming and then went upstairs, took my makeup off, put on my eyelash serum, threw on these pajamas from Skims. They're so comfy and all of the ladies are lined up because it is now their dinner time. With daylight savings, I've been going to bed so early. I went to bed last night at 10 and the night before that at nine. Normally I'm up to like midnight or one, so it's been early for me and I'm so tired today, but we had a really fun productive work day and let's feed these girls cause I'm a single mom who works two jobs who loves her kids and never stop. They're so cute. Okay, you have to see. Let me get their food ready and then I place it down and they stay in their spots and then when I say go, 
they all like cross each other. It's so cute. Okay. Like clockwork. <laughs> it's time. Everybody stay. Are you ready for the cutest thing ever? One, two, three. Okay. <laughs> Everyone goes to their spots. So cute. Here Luna goes. Monchin, monchin. We got a mo, we got a doe. So cute. Good morning, guys. I'm coming on to end the vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Ollie, come say hi. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> we love you so much, and I'll catch you next time. Ooh, you smell so good. Yeah. What perfume or cologne? The YSL, the blue one. Ooh, it smells amazing. Oh, that's what Cal wears. That's why. Okay, love you. Bye. I smell like a man. <laughs>